two dollars on a do-ray Fuel by the wine And I'll put it in the jukebox One time at a time Dime at a time, Del Reef from way back there Sometime in the past, I forget when But anyway, uh, before my time, actually That's why I forget uh, I wasn't there. But anyway, uh, my name's Keith Williams with Fretmore Guitar Lessons where we fret more, stress less, and make a whole lot of music. And we're going to do that tonight on this great old country classic. Three chord country song, my favorite kind. Uh, and uh, I'm going to show you these chords. Give us a thumbs up on this if you could and, and would. <laughs> and uh, share us on social media and all that kind of thing. And uh, subscribe to us. It'll be great. And uh, so anyway, here's the chords on this great song here. We're going to do an A in there. You can get that A, as I always say, one finger, two finger, or three. You know, or these three, whichever three you want to get. And uh, I've got a D in there and an E, okay? We've got some licks in there. Uh, one of the licks, the, one of the main licks, I guess, is the, uh, uh, and you can get this however you want to. Uh, I'm, I'm grabbing the third and fourth string, so the, the G and D string, okay? And I'm starting here at the fifth fret. And of course, I'm using the A position, so I'm, I'm, I'm kind of borrowing just those two strings, G and D, third and fourth. Okay, uh, you could just do the G string if you want to. Like at the end of it, what I did that little lick there is uh, I'm grabbing the G string and I'm going fifth, fourth, second, going to the D string and going fifth, fourth, second, and the A string going third, second, open, open, open. Okay, so that beginning part is. It sounds better with the two strings, you can kind of hear them. If I just do one, it's a little bit empty there, okay? And then there's also an opening lick, and I'm just going to kind of, I'll, I'll walk you through this a little bit. I'm not real great at showing licks, I'll be honest with you, but I'm going to show you this lick. It's actually for the beginning and the middle, and it's similar to what he does. So we're starting on the D string, the second and fourth fret, doing a hammer on, okay? And then we're going to the G string. Fourth, G, third, or uh, let me let me do D and G. D, G, B string down here on the fifth fret. G, going down to this from the fourth to the sixth. Back to the fourth. Ah. Okay, so I'll do it real slow one time. Uh, we're, I'm staying on that the G string when I'm sliding down there, okay? So we're on the D string, going to the G. There's our G, now our B. G. Still on the G. Still, all that's on the G. And then we're doing our little uh, uh, G and D here on the 5th, 4th, and 2nd. Okay, and you can do that G, you can slide. I think they're doing that a lot of that on the steel guitar anyway, and so I'm doing a little slide in there, uh, and it's it's close. Uh, you can if you don't want to do that, you just want to jump in and just go. You can just start it like that, okay? All right, so it's two uh, two verses, and uh, and then we do the chorus twice, and it's going to be the same. I think the progression progression is all is the same all the way through the song, I'm pretty sure. Uh, all right, so we do that that last part there. My whole life saving. One thing I was doing too in the cover, and I, I was doing it throughout the verse. I didn't do it that time because I was, I was concentrating on telling you where to change. But uh, it's just uh, I'm kind of in the A that I'm playing anyway. I'm doing it open, open strings, grabbing the G and D, okay, and I'm sliding from the uh, first fret to the second. So just coming up, plucking up G and D, or yeah, G and D. So I do that once in a while throughout the uh, verse. I usually do it a couple times. Okay. 
And uh, so like my whole life savings, two dollar bill. I don't do it every time. I think I, I do it the first time, the first line and the third line. I think that's how I've done it. Okay, so going into the chorus then, uh, I think he goes, maybe he might do that part again right before the chorus uh, after two dollars in a jukebox one time at a time that's the verse two dollars in a jukebox time at a time and what i was doing there is just i'm just raising my my uh, uh index finger and, and just grabbing those grabbing that g and d open okay play the same old song about Do that I did it wrong, but anyway, I did it different than what I was doing. Uh, if you'll be by the wine and I'll put it in the jukebox, D, one time at a time. I'm gonna do that lick again, I'll show you that lick again. Uh, a, lot, a lot of this stuff I'm doing, you know, you don't have to do that, you know, and you can or you can do it a little different, you know, do it however you want to. Uh, I show you some things so you can take it and improve on it. <laughs> Hopefully you improve on it uh, from what I'm doing it for sure. Uh, and, uh, you know, or change it around. Make it your own. That's, that's what you need to do with every song you sing. I don't care who sang it or how they sang it. Sing it the way you want to. All right, so here's that lick again. Pardon me, mister. If I sit down, I'm just gonna talk it this one, this one here. A misery likes company, and I believe that I found me. I'm not really talking at all. Anyway, I'm just not strumming. Uh, somebody just as lonely, hey. Probably do that lick there. I don't believe D, I'm wrong, hey. As if you had a place to go to now, E, done been gone. Beginning lick again, or the beginning, uh, just that uh, that part, not the whole lick. Uh, Two dollars in the jukebox. Okay, so he does the chorus again, and uh, and then all he does uh, at the end of it is he tags that last line. Okay, uh, so we're in A, we're, we're back to A after singing the whole chorus, and I'll put it in the jukebox. So he's repeating this last line, E, one time at a time, and then we're doing that. What I showed you in the beginning. Okay, on the uh, G string, five, four, five, four, two, uh, and D string, five, four, two, A string, uh, three, two, oh. Okay, and that's the, uh, that's it right there. That's the song. What a great lick that is. I love that. My dad probably played it a whole lot better than that. <laughs> but anyway. Uh, like I say, uh, he doesn't have social media. Uh, he does have YouTube. He does watch stuff on YouTube, but I don't think he watches my stuff, so I'm, I'm probably okay. <laughs> I'm probably okay. Don't share it with him, okay? Just don't tell him I did this. Uh, anyway, as I don't want, I don't want to, I don't want get get that phone call in the middle of the night uh, uh, telling me how bad it was. But anyway, I uh, appreciate y'all tuning in as always. It's always a pleasure. And if you could give us a thumbs up on this one, subscribe to us if you would. Check out our links down below. We've got some products and things that uh, fret more products uh, fret more stress less make music uh, on a t-shirt and hats and things like that we've also got some games that my family and I created flip floppers and now and how with names like that you got to check them out you just got to you know you just can't help it there's an Etsy store you can check those out on and uh, if you could share us on social media as I said and uh, check out our other videos out there like I said be sure to check out the cover on this one if you want to follow along with it and I appreciate y'all tuning in hope you're having a great night we'll see y'all next time thanks